Hello. Nomad Sculpt Quick Shots Part 19. I sculpt quick uh, such a little tree. I switch to the Nomad app and I delete everything. Um, we need um, a tube in the front view. Come on. Um, Turn the wireframe on, check the orthographic view, uh, outline is on, and uh, now we, we can draw a curve. Um, in the top is a radi the radius button, and with this uh, handles you can adjust it uh, to make it like this. You can add a few points. Um, to make it a little bit uh, curvier um, and you can change the view and uh, make this um, like this and when you're fine you can validate this shape uh, or this object um, so we can go a step back and uh, we can also um, reduce the um, the topology um, I think uh, 18 is okay and uh, we can reduce it in this way also a little bit and validate it um, now we can make a few adjustments um, oh, the mask is a little bit too big we can mask a few parts this is uh, the sculpting part um, I I don't do um, too much detail um, on this you can sculpt your own way uh, hold the mask button and invert the mask and with a gizmo you can bring this uh, a little bit outside and adjust it uh, like this um, the the rest you can sculpt your own um, uh, like like you want um, hold the mask button and swipe upwards or swipe um, you can check um, in the topology what subdivision uh, does um, or a flat subdivision and subdivide it again and um, at this point you can um, use the move um, the move brush to adjust these parts or the drag brush and sculpt um, for the branches um, we need another tube we need the curve and uh, in, we can use the front view and draw draw the branch um, we can use the radius function and make it thinner at the end. Um, and and add a few points. Um, we can use uh, in the top um, auto save. Okay, in the top there's a mirror button. Um, we can uh, turn the gizmo on and the gizmo uh, we can use to the, um, move to the origin uh, and we can adjust the gizmo. Um, I hope it helps. Um, we can edit the pivot and bring it uh, Bring it over, check 
Here is the top view. It's okay. And now we can move the origin again. And now we turn on the mirroring function and we bring it in a position like this and use the radial symmetry. And now we are fine. Um, we can bring this object in the pro oh nah not this. Okay. Um, in the topology settings, we can reduce the uh, the division. Six is okay, and we can reduce this also a little bit. And now we can validate this object. And um, symmetry off. And bring it in position. For example, this is also lower branches, so we can adjust it uh, with the size and and so on. Um, on the left side, there's a clone button. You can press it, and now you can bring a second one, shrink it a little bit, and check the positions. In the top view, you can use a rotation, and you can clone it again, bring it up. Scale it a little bit. Check, check the position. And rotate it a little bit. And the last one, clone again, bring it to the top. Scale it down. Rotate it a little bit and check the positions. Okay. Um, you can use the drag uh, brush to um, to adjust the branches in in the position you want to make it a little bit um, not so symmetrical um, when you when you change the br brush size a little bit you, you can uh, adjust it like this and uh, you can do it um, for every um, brush uh, for every branch section you want You can turn the wireframe off and um, I think these branches are a little bit too long. I can use the trim function, rectangular, and trim them off. Um, the rest is, uh, of the thing is sculpting uh, on the on the tree. Um, you can hold the smooth button and um, I turn on the outline again. Smooth button and select um, all the objects and um, force paint it um, force paint this. And you can use um, the post processing um, to make it look like this chromatic aberration is okay and curvature um, in this uh, 
setting you can um, bring a nice effect uh, so like outlines um, to the tree um, and when you turn the outline off it looks like this um, you can remesh it um, a voxel remesh it and have fun with the tree <laughs> and drag which one is active with it's funny have fun with sculpting ciao